I always tell people, why do you feel different when you play doubles? You know, when you play doubles and you miss a shot, like you go up and hug your opponent, you give a high five, everybody forgets what just happened. Where in singles, it's a different feeling that you have and you got to have the ability to let it go. You know what I mean? And that's the hardest thing to do. Okay. And that's what greatness is mastered because you know, as well as I do, there's better athletes out there on the tour through the test of time that they don't have any grand slams, but they were the best athletes on the tour. And it's, it's a game of inches from one ear to another, just like the game of life. And it's mind control and you got to have the ability to flip it. But that's a big thing when you're playing like, like tennis or now for the game of life, how you respond to it. If it's a, a bad day outside or it's cold or whatever, I appreciate every day. Okay, it says a little differ, but nothing has changed. What has changed? What has changed if you're down 5-0? Nothing has changed. You still had a long way to go. But if you look at it, it's over, it's probably over. You see, greatness done, look at that. You know a tennis match can change like that. Life, you can't let other things make you happy or sad. It can help you a little bit, but when you become mentally strong, and you can control things yourself. Listen, everybody needs a helping hand, but it's getting into a routine. It's training yourself that way. And I actually like problems because I know that's gonna create another opportunity for something better. And I kind of like failure, okay? Because you'll try harder. I don't want people, I've told them this, I don't want people to come up and say, you're the best. I mean, they can say it once in a while, you're the best or you're that. I, I, I like constructive criticism, not every day, because if you're not getting better, you're getting worse.